Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. Or if you're new here, I'm Laura. And I'm Ryan and we are Disney Pin Love. <laughs> All right, so today we are doing something kind of random. Yeah, we are <laughs> trying eggnog. So really, truly, neither of us, we were talking about this, neither of us to our knowledge or recollection have ever tried eggnog before. No, like I know for 100% sure I've never had it. I don't know if I was made to like as a kid try it 30 years ago. I don't think like my parents aren't egg eggnog people, so I doubt it. <laughs> So yes, we well, are two virgin eggnoggers here. Yes, so... And we, you know, I just I just have to say, like, <laughs> no expense was spared. We splurged. We got the world's best eggnog. Yes. And the brand is President's Choice. So, I mean, would the president choose anything but the world's best? <laughs> so, yeah. So, we got this. Also, Merry Christmas Eve. Woo! And we're going to do a cheers to Vlogmas <laughs> when we pour our drink. But yeah, so this is PC. I don't know. Do they have that in the States? No, they I don't. don't. Think so. Okay, so it says rich, rich and clean. We don't have a president in Canada, in Canada either, just so that's oh. it's sort of funny. But Anyways, it says a rich and creamy <laughs> holiday classic made from a traditional recipe with cream, spices, and a touch of rum. And then at the bottom, it says, in our humble opinion, this is the best eggnog money can buy. So... I don't know. We're going to crack it open and we're going to pour it. So we have like a few different varieties yeah, we're to gonna try. Yeah, we're going to do like sample flights, but we're starting with just oh. cold out of the fridge. Is that enough for you? Sure. Okay, so yeah. Cold out of the fridge. We're going to try it hot. We're going to try it spiked. And we even have a latte, an eggnog <laughs> latte from a, uh, a local place. Cheers, Cheers to you. Should be the Cheers okay. <laughs> to everybody else. Thanks for watching everything, all our videos and following along. Yeah. Um, and no, I think it would be awkward to, to try this. We could try, but I've never... Uh, no, <laughs> no that's, we it. won't do it. <laughs> okay, well, cheers. So, so cheesy. Should we count down? Yeah, sure. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh. Okay. So, I don't like the smell that you get when you put the glass to your face because you do get the rum, but like, how is it just sold in the grocery store? Anyways, I get a funny smell that I don't like, but I like the taste. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, it's, it's not what I expected. The texture is okay. It's almost like a... You know, it's, it's somewhere in between like just a normal glass of milk and a milkshake kind of thing. Like it's not that thick. Yeah. It's actually, yeah. There's I'm little impressed. things in it. I wonder well, if that's the nog. <laughs> I think that's probably more so the spices. Ah. We could read the ingredients. Ryan didn't know what eggnog was. And also then he said, I don't think I actually want to know until maybe never. It's very polarizing from what I've gleaned. Because I was talking to people at work about this. And, uh, you know, what? it's very much a love it or hate it thing. Yeah. I can't say I would enjoy more than, like, one little carton. Because I don't know when I would drink something like this. Like, I'm not a super, like... So what is in it? Know. I'm looking at the ingredients. And okay. Yeah, okay. So I, let's I tell them, like the... and then we're going to get to microwaving it. So there is... The first ingredient is milk ingredients. Sugar, water, liquid egg yolk, guar gum, carrageenan, carrageenan. Natural flavor, rum, annatto, turmeric, and spice. Yeah. So, interesting. So, we're going to pour a little mug, microwave this, and then we will be right back to try a few different varieties. All right. So. We are back. <laughs> you have uh, taken the eggnog, the uh, lait du poulet. Poul. Poul. <laughs> en français. Milk of chicken is, uh, no. It's not. It would have a T on it. Yeah. But anyways. We microwaved it, and we have these fancy cups, so cheers. Hopefully it's not too hot. Oh. Okay. It brings up the spices a little bit more, I think. Yeah. The heat. That's I think nice. maybe I prefer it cold, frankly. I was going to say I prefer it warm, because then it's like Soothing, super warming. Nice. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll prefer it warm with rum coming up next. Yeah. But it's it's so not bad. Like I've got like I don't know I that know. it's something that I'll be like, oh, we gotta we gotta get more kind of no, thing. No, I think like once but, a season though. Yeah. But yeah, I think okay. It's just not what I expected. 
Mm. Like the flavor is just, yeah, I don't know. I don't even know how to describe it. It's, it's not what I expected, but it's not bad. Well, you guys have to let us know in the comments down below what you think of eggnog, because <laughs> we'll be curious. But so next we're gonna try um, warmed up eggnog with rum. So we have this Appleton Estate dark rum. And we're gonna just see. Yeah. So I had a coworker tell me a hot tip mm -hmm. was uh, Deserono is that's the way to go. I'm gonna water mine down more. I don't but yeah, know. we've got um, I think like a solid couple ounces of rum in here each. Do you want me to stir it for you? Oh, you're just going for it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I feel right? you. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I, it it works. Oh. Nope, that's way too much rum for what we're doing, for the amount of eggnog that we're having, I think. Are you just kidding me? Here we go. Puts, puts hair on your chest, <laughs> as they say. Oh, I'm going back to drinking the warm plain because I like that better. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, oh, I hate that I'm drink. never opposed to that, but I guess it's just like, I would rather have a cocktail and just in general, like the... The combination of alcohol and like sort of milk kind of drinks. It's like, no. Maybe I'd have a brown cow or something, although I'd probably just have straight Baileys, but I, no. that's definitely my least favorite because I would rather just have like a traditional yeah. kind of cocktail yeah, that's gross. or just eggnog. Yeah, I'm sticking to just eggnog. So far, warm eggnog. Cold for me. Is my favorite. So. Okay, so we'll BRB with the last one. We got it from a local place in our town here that has a cute little stamp, early bird coffee. I don't know, it like smells and feels kind of warm. Do you want me to microwave it a bit or just try it? Let's just try it. Okay, so it's an eggnog latte. So let's see. Okay, I don't get any eggnog at all, but it tastes good. I don't get eggnog either, but it does taste good. Don't Maybe, it like, I wonder if it's, if they would have used the eggnog with sort of the milk that was frosted, or if they did uh, some of those eggnog spices and like a latte. I think it has actual eggnog in it. It's not, I mean, that's I'm nice. Trying. It's very mild, but. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, I mean, I was kind of scared to do this video because I thought I would be like, absolutely disgusted by eggnog but in the end i think i like it and i would yeah. enjoy like one or two cartons a season and well and i, I like yeah. that uh, for our very first time we did try the world's best that's true you know? yeah i mean maybe next year we'll try making our own yeah yeah or like <laughs> the world's second best we'll see so. <laughs> anyways <laughs> thanks everybody for following along with our vlogmas videos we hope you have a magical christmas tomorrow make sure you stay tuned for pin time Last one. Yeah. Wish us luck. <laughs> and we'll see you guys. Yeah, when will after we be Christmas back? to share what we got for Christmas. So it, we won't be gone for long. Yeah. Really, it's only like two, a day. two or three days, probably <laughs> 26, 27, something like that. Yeah. So we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. It's pin time. He's broken again. How long can he? because this is our last day of Vlogmas, our last day of Magic Launch Bay Advent Calendar. Number 24. So it's been fun. I am excited to Got see this one. Cellophane on the back here. <laughs> Pretty chunky feeling. I'm gonna be polite okay. and show you guys first. It's gonna be a good one, please. <gasps> yes! Pretty I cool. I got one of these last year, but it was, um, Coco? Yes, thank you. It was Coco, but I'm very excited about this one. I am having a oh. hard time with the uh, the Mickey backers. Well, well no, I, I got it. I think this one's limited edition. It says so on the front. Okay. Right? Oh, yeah. Ellie of 500. So this is wow. 5 of 12 in the series. Ellie of 500. Go ahead and show you the back quick. Cool. Turn it around. Okay. There you go. Sully in silhouette. And I mean, Mike too, of course, but we all know well why Laura is excited. 
Yeah, that's cute. I think I will probably keep that for my collection. Very nice. Yeah. There you go. Not bad. So that was fun. Hope um, you uh, put cookies out for Santa tonight and yeah. uh, some, you know, some carrots for the reindeer. Yeah. And have a very Merry Christmas. Yes. <laughs>